<laughs> At barely five days old, these kittens are already fighting to survive. Hey, you trying to adopt? Add it to the collection. <laughs> Jasmine would love to have another That's friend. Say. Yeah. Hi. On Tuesday, these cats were found in a bag by someone driving along I-90. The cats were brought to Seattle Humane, where Christina Charlton says they needed to act quickly. First thing that they received is warmth. Uh, newborn kittens cannot regulate their own body temperature, uh, and being cold can actually be fatal for them. Since January, Seattle Humane has taken in more than 2,500 cats and kittens, and nearly half of them are kittens six months or younger. There he goes, sucking it down. With no available surrogate moms for the kittens, Seattle Humane turned to Dave Schwimmer's family to help foster them. Yeah, like that. Good boy, Banjo. The kittens will require around-the-clock care and feeding. So at about two to three weeks, the, the number of meals a day goes down, but their stomach capacity goes up, so they're able to eat more with each meal. Oh, they're oh, chugging. And though they're in a better situation right now, their survival isn't guaranteed. It's super disappointing. Like you, you guys are saying, there's so many options. Leaving them on the side of the road, I mean, what kind of person does that? Tony Black, King 5 News. Now, Seattle Humane wants the public to know that if you cannot handle your animals, bring them in. They will take them by appointment. And you can also take pets or even strays to King County's Pet Adoption Center, which is in Kent.